Amphibious boats owning a boat is great if you don't live too far away from the water. But there's often a problem with getting the boat to the water and you can't just park at any shore you want. If there's no pier there, amphibious boats are a perfect solution for a safe beach landing which requires no infrastructure because the boats are equipped with tracks the U design allows the boats to get safely out of the water on any shore from soft sand and wet mud to uneven rocks and pebble beaches these amphibious boats can truly handle all types of terrain. They're capable of climbing the inclines up to 22 degrees regardless of the surface and the tracks deliver an even pressure on the ground that's partly thanks to their perfectly positioned centre of gravity. The front of the boat is very light and empty. Unlike the back where the engine's fuel tank and landing gear are located, this keeps them both balanced even with 11 persons on the bow. The landing gear is designed to withstand a load of up to 16 tonnes, and once submerged, it folds up into the hull without interfering with propulsion. The hull design allows these boats to cruise smoothly, even in rough seas, reaching speeds of over 56 miles per hour thanks to two 300 horsepower engines. 12 RC New Zealand Boat Building Company Sea Legs has produced a whole series of popular amphibious boats recently, but the 12RC wasn't just the latest of them. It's been called the world's largest amphibious boat. The 39-foot boat features Sea Legs' largest commercial-grade amphibious system with a fully lockable cockpit and one 32-gallon fuel tank. The two engines provide 850 horsepower and the boat itself can carry up to 12 people, including the captain. When moving on land, the boat uses a built-in four-stroke gasoline engine with 94 horsepower. It's worth mentioning that the amphibious boat is not too fast on land and accelerates only to 5 miles per hour. However, you'll hardly need more speed when you're so huge and have only three wheels when on water. The boat reaches a stable 46 miles per hour. This kind of amphibious transport is very useful in countries with a lot of islands and in some places it can even save lives. Sea legs. Boats have long been valued among rescuers as perfect vessels for emergency response in Malaysia. For example, police rescue and security services use these amphibious boats well, not the 39-foot long ones of course, and in some countries amphibious boats are even used by firefighters. Fire departments and government agencies have been able to save many lives thanks to the unique sea legs technology and a list of regions where these boats are used to fight fires includes Jamaica, Italy and Bangkok. Yang Wang, U8 Yang Wang. U8 car is called the Chinese answer to Land Rover Defender. This SUV was officially unveiled on January 5, 2023 and it immediately demonstrated its distinctive feature, the ability to turn 360 degrees on the spot. A very handy feature if you reach a dead end and realize you'd rather go back. The car is driven by four electric motors with a total capacity of 1100 horsepower. The electric car accelerates from zero to 62 miles per hour in three seconds. Yang Wang U8 is also equipped with a motor waterproof and a body sealing technology which allows the SUV to float on water. There are preset driving modes, including the ones for driving on ice, snow, desert wetlands and so on. The manufacturer also claimed that the SUV can continue driving at 75 miles per hour even with a flat tyre. This is thanks to the vehicle's ability to adjust the torque a thousand times per second, keeping it under control. Proto's RMX2 Asmodeus, have you ever heard of the Rams mobile car brand? This Belarusian company has developed a very unusual and very expensive SUV that looks like something between a Batmobile and a Hummer. It boasts excellent off-road capability thanks to the huge wheels positioned at the corners and the front grille is illuminated by LEDs lighting can be adjusted depending on the preferences of the user. The doors of the SUV rotate 90 degrees along the body of the car and go upwards. The vehicle's most peculiar detail is a couple of electrically operated retractable tracks which help the vehicle get out of a tough situation if the wheels can't handle it. The off-road vehicle's chassis is composite. The suspension is pneumatic with a ground clearance of 14 inches. 
the interior of the car also stands out. Gloominess goes hand in hand with illumination. Plus, there's a set of screens and a hook. Oh, it doesn't go well together with the concept of conquering tough roads, but it might come in handy if you get stuck in traffic. H1 Panther. The manufacturer of this all-terrain vehicle claims the H1 Panther is the most versatile vehicle ever imagined. This is the fifth and most advanced amphibious model from Watercar the vehicles are built to withstand the harshest conditions from rough terrain to deep water. One Panther's a real all-terrain amphibious vehicle which can accelerate on the highway and move through the water at 40 miles per hour. It's based on the Humvee car water car, completely disassembles the original car and then rebuilds it from scratch. Most of the heavy steel and cast iron parts are replaced with new lightweight aluminum alloy and stainless steel parts. Transforming a Humvee land only vehicle into a high speed amphibious vehicle is an extremely labor consuming process and takes two zero 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 man hours, but the result is worth it. The amphibious vehicle was even approved by the US Coast Guard. The all-terrain vehicle accommodates up to six passengers and can switch to water mode in just 20 seconds. The fuel tank capacity of 38 gallons is enough to cover 380 miles on land and 96 MPUF miles on water. Range Rover Clawson the Range Rover is one of the most luxurious full-size SUVs thanks to its exquisite interior improved handling and overall very comfortable driving experience. But now we'll talk not just about the SUV but about the presidential car based on it. It's the unique Range Rover Clawson created on the basis of the Range Rover Autobiography SUV and featuring the highest levels of ballistic protection 7 and 9. You could say it's a tank-like limousine that features elongated rear doors, armoured glass, a panoramic roof that slides almost like in a convertible, and Kevlar tyres, they keep the limousine driving even if the tyres are shot. Naturally, everything inside is luxurious and full of high technology. But despite the luxury, the military-grade SUV can withstand any armour-piercing incendiary bullets and even grenade explosions. Lift box. What if a truck could drop down its floor actually? It's not that impossible because there's lift box. It was designed to make urban transportation more efficient and is based on modular high strength steel chassis. Designs, lift box saves time. The learning ramp or container can be lowered to ground level in eight seconds with 25 delivery addresses. You save 18 of time or one and a half hours and that's quite a lot in addition. Liftbox allows loading at ground level without using any steps. Any cargo, even on the smallest wheels, is easy to roll in and out, which not only saves time, but also the health of the movers. Fibian, an amphibious truck. Yes, it's a real thing designed as a platform for amphibious transport, and for disaster relief, Fibian is considered the largest high-speed amphibious vehicle built so far. The truck reaches speeds of 30 miles on water and can go from water to land in less than 10 seconds where it can drive at 70 miles per hour. The truck's equipped with two turbo diesel engines with a maximum power of 250 horsepower each and can accommodate three crew members plus 12 passengers. The latter, however, can be replaced by one and a half tons of cargo. The Bond ejector seat ejection seats are always featured in movies, and one would think they'd be much more common in real life. However, they aren't used in any car as a safety feature because such a device is more likely to endanger a person's life than save it. The roof would have to be removed, and there's also the chance of landing right on the road under the wheels of another car. In short, there are a lot of factors. Even Formula One pilots don't have the ability to eject from their cars, but a car capable of ejecting a passenger was once designed as part of the experiment while it was tested on a crash dummy. High rail truck since 1962. Wilcox Bodies has managed to earn a reputation as a world-renowned manufacturer of trailers, 
Whether you're on the open road on the highway or in the middle of nowhere, the trailer will live up to its reputation. But it's not just the trailer where you can transport your equipment, thanks to the extra wheels designed for railroad tracks, your vehicle will be able to move around on rails, whereas the standard width between wheels simply wouldn't allow it. Rail bodies are made of aluminum, which means they provide a drastic reduction in overall vehicle weight, increased payload capacity, increased durability, all in all, all the best features you can hope for. They're also designed specifically for operating in the railroad environment, whether it's track repair or replacement equipment maintenance, or any other work the full LED light system helps you find your way even in low visibility. Load Handler Here's another accessory designed to make unloading easier. It turns your pickup truck into a one-way conveyor. It's the perfect tool for gardeners, log merchants, loggers, farmers, nursery owners, builders. Basically for anyone who needs to transport loose bagged or palletized materials in a pickup truck load, Handler consists of a durable low friction polymer fabric rolled onto a steel bar. The unit held in place by sturdy bodywork friendly brackets is strapped very quickly. No welding or drilling is required and load handler is easy to remove by simply unstrapping it. Using load handler guarantees an increased level of safety, no more standing at the back of the truck and straining your back while shoveling you. Don't even have to climb in the back to unload the cargo. The system does it all for you. That's all thanks for watching. Like, share and subscribe for upcoming videos. Thank you.